Hi, this is Claire from Katie and Claire. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make a fishtail bracelet on your fingers. So first you do as normal. You're going to put the figure eight on two of your fingers like this. And then you're going to put two other. So you're going to take this other hand and you're going to put it on top of that and it'll look like this. And then you're going to take the other rubber band and put it on top of that one. You might want to scooch it down a little bit so it'll look like that. And now, for when you do the fishtail, if you you can do any types of colors for this. Like you can't, you don't have to do just one color. You're going to take the bottom of this eight. And you're going to put it on top. Then you're going to take the other part of the bottom and put it on top. Then, you have to, you have to put another rubber band, whatever color is on top like this, as you can see. You will put that color over top of that. And then you'll just keep flipping this part up. And it'll look like that. And now there will essentially be a bottom like this. And so you are just going to keep putting rubber bands over this one and then folding these two up. Right now, I don't want you to have to see me do this whole whole introduction for them. So I'm just going to make a small ring. Now the third time there's going to be like three two fish tails go, going down. It'll look like a double normal bracelet right now, but once you start really doing it then it will and won't be. And so I'm going to put another green on. You you can switch colors. Like it doesn't have to be all the same color. And then You'll just keep doing it and doing it. And so, and around your, which this is my fourth time, around your seventh time, it'll be pretty long. But if you're going to make the normal one, you are going to need about uh, 50 rubber bands. But if you're making the one that's just a ring, you will need about um, maybe just 20. Um, these rubber bands, they can be, you can make di lots of different types of them. Uh, this one they're making right now, I am pretty sure this one, this fishtail, is a double fishtail. There's a double, there's a one that's a four, there's a six fishtail, and there's also a 12 fishtail, which is really cool and it's very small but the fish shells are very small but you can still like put it on and it, it there's like four fish tails and one and the six is kind of like this but the the rubber bands will be skinnier and there will be more fish tail and you'll have to use about 100 rubber bands um also for the 12 one you will have to use like 150 um, if you are just doing a normal one, and not the, the four, I'm doing the four one right now, but if you're doing, like, the normal one, like a two or something, then you will only have to use about 20 rubber bands. Um, I'm just going to say this is what it will look like when it is done. It, um, this is the ring. This one is a four. So these two look a little bit alike. And um, when you are finished with this product, um, you can also put like, if say this one is like this, you can put a different color right here so that the endings will be different colors. And that right here, if you put like a pink right here, it'll make the thing pop and then you could put a chain here. And also, um, just a tip for if you want to, if you have uh, charms and not C clips, you can put a charm here instead of C clip, and it'll stay 
because those are a little bit bigger than uh, the the charms are a little bit bigger than the C clips that you put on. Um, this bracelet also is very like precise. If you mess one bit up, it'll usually mess the whole bracelet up. But if you have like a little tiny bit of an error, then it'll be okay. So I just got a little bit of an error right here where it started twisting right there. And it's only little, so it won't matter that it's, it's, that it's there because you can't see it when it will turn into, a, when this will turn into a bracelet. Also, if you make an error, if you put the rubber bands on the wrong place, then that, if you put them on the wrong place about five times, then the whole bracelet will be ruined. But um, if you keep on keep on keep putting them in the wrong place, then it'll actually turn into a different type of bracelet. Um, this bracelet is very, it has a lot of different types. Like, you can do this fishtail, you can do it in your hair which is also like you could do it the same way that you're doing it on a loom. You can do it with um, like anything that's um, very small and skinny. But here, I'm just going to be done now. And this um, product is very nice. So this what I'm going to do now is I'm not going to use a C clip for the end. I am going to use a charm. And um, you will just use it the same way that you use a C clip. So you will just hook it on there like that. And then you will get the other side. And you will also hook the other side onto it. And then it will turn out like this. And there are lots of different colors that you can do. So thank you for letting me do this. And I hope you subscribe it so that we can get a lot of subscribers. Thank you. Bye.